Welcome back, nerd friends, and thanks for joining us once again here on the Nerd Bench. Today, we are going to do an unboxing and a quick look at the all new, well, relatively new X Rotor 65 amp 4 in 1. If you are familiar with the Hobby Wing line of drone products, this format and this look will be nothing new to you. This is a this is a 30 by 30 platform to go into your custom DIY drones, the five inch builds, six inch, seven builds, all that fun stuff. Took the shrink wrap off and then the focus was bad. So we readjusted her focus, but here she is folks. The updated X Rotor 65 amp four in one. This is what we call the G2 version, uh, generation number two. Pop the box open and check out what you got inside. You get an XT60 for your battery plug. You get the little insulator that goes along with that. This is the brain wire that plugs into the Hobby, Rowing, the Hobby Wing uh, flight control and the speed control itself. When you go to pop these guys out of here, be real careful. What I do is I try to crush the plastic first and then work the speed control out gently. You don't just pop the speed control out. You flex the board hard enough that you can break it and you don't want well, that. Well, there you have it, the updated x rotor 30 by 30 four in one speed control this guy is a i guess you'd say a running changer and update to the 60 amp one now rated at 65 amps uh, with the thanks of some new hardware that is pretty much kind of like i don't want to say it's the exact same board because i don't know but if you were to hold this guy up side by side with the old version you'd be hard pressed to point out the differences unless somebody showed you but you can see there that uh trademark quality hobby wing manufacturing everything looks real nice and clean in there if you want to find out the hard specs of what changed i will have a chart in the description down below that shows the two of them side by side on our website but there has been basically some changes to the uh, rated amp that's now 65 amps instead of 60 due to those minor changes in uh, software, firmware, whatever you want to call it, as well as some of the hardware changes. But the format and the size, the rest of it is all pretty much exactly the same. It does everything the old version did, plus a few new things. It's got higher frequencies available to it. It's got dynamic drive frequency for the motor output as well so you can really get down on some of that new style BL heli uh, tuning if you will if you do have any questions comments or concerns about this guy please do shoot us an email north america at hobbywing.com make sure that you tune into our podcast rc stuff i'm going to be sitting down with mike and a couple pilots talking about this new speed control in the coming weeks and if you want to find that guy, just look it up on your favorite podcast service. It's RC Stuff powered by Hobbywing. I will be getting this installed. I'm going to use this as my excuse to finally, let's see if I can bring it in here, get my gigantic drone build. Look, I got to scoot the camera up. This thing's so big. But I do have a street league rig that I got for my birthday last year from the good staff here at Hobby Wing. Mike hooked that up with the guys. And I'm going to get this guy installed in there. I even have the sweet white box motors for those to get flying. And uh, this will pair right up with the Hobby Wing X Rotor flight control. Like I said, it comes with the harness and the flight controls come with that as well. So you are probably all asking yourselves if you're a racer that stumbled across this video are you going to do a 20 millimeter version of this uh, chances are most likely it would make perfect sense that the entire lineup would get similar updates and just stay tuned for for more information on that in the coming i don't know months weeks i'm not exactly sure but it only makes sense no one has told me anything official that i can talk about so as always folks thanks for tuning in another fresh episode of the charlie show new every tuesday right here on the hobby wing official youtube channel we will see you all next time